Northwestern State hosting a top 15 for the second week in a row as Sam Houston State comes to town first quarter. Sam Houston up seven and adding to it. Ty Brock connecting with Davian Davis for the score. Bearcats lead 14-0. Now a 14-7 ball game. Shelton Epler looking downfield. He's got a wide open Quan Shorts. That's a demon touchdown. Ties this game at 14. Later the second. Epler throwing again, this time to Jazz Ferguson in the corner. That gives the Demons a 21-14 lead. But the Bearcats not going away. Brock finding Davis again. That's Davis's third touchdown of the game. Ties this game at 21. Sam Houston now up 23-21. Brock rolling out, looking for a receiver, but it is picked off by Hayden Bourgeois. And he takes it all the way to the house. The Demon picked six. That gives NSU a 28-23 lead at the half, but all Sam Houston in the second half. 42-28 the final. Brad Cisak was in Natchitoches for this one and has more. Brad? Yeah, Tim, this one was, as they say, a tale of two halves. That Demons offense that was virtually unstoppable in the first half, unable to score any points in the final 30 minutes. A big reason for that was Sam Houston's ability to take Jazz Ferguson virtually out of the game after his first two touchdowns in the second quarter. It's their third straight loss for the Demons, and they say this was a tough one. Uh, I feel like the defense did a great job forcing turnovers, and uh, I feel like offense, we uh, – we started off a little slow, and then we picked up a little, and then turnovers got the best of us, and we, we didn't take advantage of the opportunities on sudden changes like those turnovers the defense got for us, and uh, it was too late to make a comeback. The Demons say the best way to get over this loss is just to move on and come back to work tomorrow. For now, reporting at Turpin Stadium, I'm Brad Cisak. Tim, let's go back to you in the studio.